Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is T and I'm back with another Naruto Shippuden episode reaction video. But I just want to remind you guys before I begin that I'm on Patreon and you can have access to all these videos unedited version over there. However, if you're here and you still haven't subscribed to my channel, then please subscribe to my channel. Show me some love. And if you really like my videos, press the like button. And if you have any comments for me, anything at all, do leave them down here. Okay then, what we're waiting for? Let's begin. Without a doubt, he's matured. Yeah, you are taking him so lightly. You shouldn't. Your mistake. He's still not strong enough. Oh, he's still not strong enough. So what are you gonna do? Oh man, those boys are turning into shurikens. It hurts, but I know it's just a genjutsu. Oh, these are not real. Okay, so this is still in happening in the genjutsu. Hmm? Why is his skin like Gara? Naruto. Is that Sasuke? Is that Sasuke? It's been far too long, Naruto. Wow. What a scene. Half of him is Sasuke now. I'm telling you, Itachi is quite creative in his genjutsu, man. He knows the weak spot and he attacks that person over there. I should have finished you off the last time we saw each other. And I hate that look of Sasuke. I liked Sasuke in the first episode. He looked okay, even though he was wearing that pink belt, pink rope belt. But then, still, he looked really nice and handsome. But this one, this look, pathetic. Like, disgustingly pathetic. Why, why Naruto? When Sasuke left, why didn't you bring him back to me? I was wrong to believe in you. Whoa, that's awful. It's like, what's happening? All his body parts are turning into someone. Ah, uh, yuck. You even protect your closest friends. I expected more from you, but you're a failure. As oh. Always, no matter what, you come out ahead. <gasps> So basically, at this point of time, um, Itachi is attacking Naruto's um, weak spots. Like, Sasuke is telling him, I should have killed you on that day, but I spared you. So, like, another weakness at that point. Sakura is judging him for not bringing um, Sasuke back. So he failed Sas uh, Sakura. So that's kind of a... Um, uh, you know, a deep thing, which which is back of his mind, which is in back of his mind. So that has been, you know, pinpointing him. So um, he's picking up on to all those uh, small things, which is his weakness or are like, uh, you know, those points which can, which hurts him. So even um, Kakashi saying that you're not good enough. And then Gara, he failed Gara too because he is on the rescue mission and he's still not able to reach Gara. So all those um, weaknesses are popping up and making him um, still, you know, live in this genjutsu and messing up his brain right now. So I don't know how he's gonna break this genjutsu, but I really do not understand where the other team members are right now. Like where is Kakashi? What is he doing? I thought he had some kind of a, um, he had a anecdote with this um, thing that uh, Itachi do. Uh, he said that I am not uh, as stupid as earlier and I know how to, uh, work around it. So what is he doing? Why is he letting Naruto uh, in this genjutsu? Like, I don't understand. Let's see. Just a genjutsu. I know that's all it is. But still. It's just... Naruto. Why did I believe in you? This is really funny. Sakura popping out from his stomach. 
Easy life. I'll finish you. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. This isn't happening. But I can't. Let me get this straight. I mean, I get the basics of what you're talking about. The part where you temporarily stop your chakra flow and direct the extra power at the enemy to destroy. <laughs> oh, cool. But then I really don't know where Kakashi, Sakura, and that granny is. So. Liar, you broke your promise to me. Such a disappointment. You always get. <sighs> that doesn't look good. Somebody give me chakra. They're not even here. I don't know where they are. Kakashi Sensei. Need your chakra. <gasps> oh, Naruto, are you all right? What happened to me? You were caught in a genjutsu, but you're gonna be fine. We all funneled our chakra into you and broke the hold. <sighs> oh, I don't get it. Where did his shadow clones go? What do you mean, his shadow clones? Why, he's used no such thing the entire time we've been here. Yeah, all of a sudden you kind of freaked out and started shooting off your Rasengan at absolutely nothing. Don't you remember any of that? <gasps> oh, so even this was a Genjutsu. You're saying I was already in the Genjutsu? I'm afraid he's using more than just a visual jutsu. Man, he's good. Itachi is amazing. I think it's about time for the main event. Better get it together, Naruto. Hey, snap out of it, will ya? Come on, Naruto. I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this wasn't... As long as I think it is. This was like... This happened in a... Uh, it happened really quickly. Okay. Kind of makes sense now. Firestar. Phoenix Flower Jutsu. Whoa, what a dodge! He's not done yet! <laughs> Firestar. Fireball Jutsu. Wow, Itachi is amazing, man. <gasps> Kakashi. Lightning blade. Oh. Oh, so Kakashi was distracting him while... What happened? Did he do it? Naruto! What the... F He's still standing tall. Not even a, like, well, nothing now, at all. He's learned an interesting jutsu, hasn't he? However, man, I didn't think he'd survive it that easy. I could have sworn we were going to get the drop in him with Kakashi Sensei's lightning blade as a diversion. His Sharingan is a real problem. He can instantly foresee what I'm going to do. Oh, yeah, with Sharingan. So that's how he moved away. Again! No way this is gonna work unless I combo attack with Kakashi Sensei. On top of that, I need a powerful jutsu that'll take him out in one shot. Looks like I gotta try out my new trick. Oh, is he talking about what Jiraiya asked him not to use that power? Where's Naruto? Did he make it? Wait. Don't worry, my dear. This jutsu is Kakashi's. 
Wait, are you saying... The mist is getting thicker, so we both need to focus now. You must keep your attention firmly fixed on Kakashi's presence. Oh my god, right. Kakashi copied that when Zabuza did this hidden mist thing. He copied it. Wow, Kakashi is amazing too. He copies all those jutsu. Mist jutsu. Quite an effective technique to prevent one from casting a genjutsu. Ah. Unless, of course, one possesses the Sharingan. Oh. Kakashi. Can we please stop this childish game of hide and seek? Why are you listening to him? Sure. Why not? He's he's just acting too confident now. Are you going back to your younger self of being an arrogant knucklehead like Naruto? That uh, Naruto is not arrogant though. Fire style, fireball, tutsu. Oh, the mist is gone. But I think that Kaka that wasn't Kakashi. I get where you're going. Awesome move, Kakashi Sensei. What was it? Oh, he went inside. <gasps> that fireball was different. Something's not right. Oh man, what on earth, earth I will not give to be that close to Kakashi the way he is right now. Itachi man, you are so close to Kakashi. Kakashi. Okay, what is he doing? He's doing Mangekyo Sharingan with Kakashi again, I think. But Kakashi said that there's something different with the fireball thing. What was different? You made him a paper, <laughs> out of paper, paper Kakashi, and he's burning him. Don't tell me Kakashi Sensei has caught any Tachi's Genjutsu. I thought he can escape it now. He learned something. Hmm? Naruto seems really confident. He's actually smiling. So there is something happening more here. Nicely done. You certainly have mastery of your jutsu. Your earth style move hid you from view for a moment. So I didn't notice the change. What do you mean? It all makes sense. Of course, my Genjutsu has no effect on you because you are a shadow clone. Ah! He's fast. Oh! So he sent a shadow clone close to Itachi so that he doesn't get entrapped into the manga character again. I do. Makes sense. Okay, I kind of missed it. Sorry, I was thinking about what Kakashi did. Of course, my Genjutsu has no effect on you. Because you are a shadow clone. He's fast. Oh. Oh, yay. Kisame is done. He got the kick of the his life. Is, over. is it? Yes. What? Man, that was amazing. Yo, my guy, you are really strong. You kicked the ass. Okay, Kisame is done, I think. Guy Sansa just beat the shit out of him. He's done. Where the hell is he? Don't tell me he escaped again. Well, no. That pretty much wraps that one up. Oh. So yes, perhaps Attack him, him and too. my shadow clone. No, Naruto. I'm on it. Huh? Huh? 
I didn't get it. What happened? Gun. That's what I'm saying. Come on, I'm practically an expert with the Rasen gun. What I really want to learn are some new jutsu. What do you say? <laughs> Don't get ahead of yourself. Do you honestly think the Rasengan you use now is good enough? Think back to when you fought with Orochimaru's four-eyed friend. Remember what happened then? Oh, Kabuto four-eyed friend. Jiraiya, man, you are savage. <laughs> he calls him four-eyed. I don't know what jutsu you learned, but you'll need to be more subtle than that if you want to hit me. My oh. very own original Rasengan. In order to increase the power of the Rasengan, you'll first need to master how to infuse more of your chakra. I won't lie to you, the training will be tough. But if you can withstand it, you'll emerge with by far the strongest weapon in your arsenal. We'll call it... Giant Rasengan! What Rasen Rasengan? So he killed Itachi? Tell me that. But it's it cannot be that easy. I see Itachi is bleeding, but why did his face change a bit? But you know Itachi cannot be dead because I think Sasuke is gonna take vengeance. Yeah. Okay, was he smirking at the end? I didn't actually realize that. It's strange. I got the feeling I'd fought him somewhere before, but... So you do not remember ever meeting this man? That's weird, because from what he was saying, it seemed like he knew everything about you, Kai-sensei. Something's going on here. There is no way I've ever met him. So that's not Kisame, right? Or was... Lady Chio, do you know who this person is? I do. His name is Yura. And he's a Jonin from our own village. I don't get it. Okay, so... When Guy sensei hit that... Hit Kisame... It was not Kisame. It was that other guy who was dead. And we don't know who that guy was. And when Naruto did the Rasengan, this was not Itachi. This was uh, Yura of Sand Village. Okay. So, so basically, Itachi and Kisame were not here. They sent their... It's not like a, is it a kind of a transformation jutsu? What, what was it? Like, they they looked like Itachi and Kisame, but then they were two different people. Yura and that other guy. And, but they fought like Itachi and Kisame. Like, they had the same power and strength as Itachi and Kisame. There was a little off as Kakashi said that he find found it like little there's something off about Itachi but then Okay so so basically Akatsuki are actually capable of sending someone else disguises themselves with the same amount of equal strength and power to go and fight someone in place of them. That's amazing. So it's some kind of a new jutsu that I'm not aware of. And Akatsuki can actually go up to that level. Okay, while I'm processing this information, uh, I think this is again something I'm like a uh, very big... Uh, I don't know, I feel like... Uh, this is one of the reasons, is that why Kai sensei was unable to recognize Kisame because he wasn't Kisame? Um, so does Kai sensei has a kind of a power to look someone beyond his appearance? Like he can see 
the real person, not what his face looked like. That's why he keeps saying that I know these moves, I know this jutsu, I know this sword, I've fought you, but I don't know you. Like it's more, there was this one statement, but I don't remember what he said, that one thing is knowing you and then there is um, the knowledge, something, something he said that, uh, so I'm, I'm still confused. Uh, I don't know if this is the reason why Kai Sensei was unable to recognize him because he was not Kisame actually. I'm not very sure. I'm, I would have to like watch other episodes to understand why Kai Sensei couldn't recognize him. Maybe he wasn't actually looking at his face and he was trying to see beyond it. I'm not sure. Okay, anyways, that was an interesting episode. So basically... Um, Naruto um, combined with Kakashi are really strong enough to battle or face off Itachi but there is again another consideration first of all this was not the real Itachi this was another guy um, Yura secondly he he has this person who was disguising as Itachi had less of Itachi's chakra so Itachi's chakra is divided into other activities right now to extract that um, spirit out of uh, Gara. and they didn't show anything about Gara in this episode so i don't know if it's okay but then that is how they could actually beat this yura guy because itachi is not at his full potential over here so it's still more to itachi and i think only Sasuke has enough power to have a face off with Itachi and that is something we will see in like episodes like really late in the show but for now with that thought I feel like Akatsuki gonna escape all this I don't think they can beat Akatsuki here I hope Kara is okay I hope they can rescue him but then it cannot be that they can beat Akatsuki in this manner because so far they look really weak as compared to Akatsuki. <sighs> That's disturbing. That motion is disturbing me. I hope. Okay, guys, I have to wrap up over here or else I will just keep thinking about it and then... Okay, I'm just gonna wrap it up. I'll watch the next episode but then I'll... I'll, I'll think about it more when I'll watch more. Okay. All right, guys. That's a wrap for this video. If you really like this video, please press the like button. If you have any comments for me, do leave them down here. And please subscribe to my channel. Please. All right, then. See you in the next video. Until then. Bye.